Hey guys, how's it going? I want to start this video off by saying I hope that everybody's doing okay. Um, I know that uh, currently we are living in a world that's uh, quite different than what we're used to, and uh, I hope everybody's doing okay. I certainly have been home for a long time now, and what I wanted to do today was do something a little bit different and come up with some projects that maybe I could put on this channel and that you guys can do at home since we're currently all home uh, together. So what I'm going to start out with today is working on the track in the back. Uh, it's been a really long time since I've done a video back here and put it on YouTube, but it's still here. And about two months ago or so, I actually raked it, uh, got rid of the leaves, and I started driving on it again. But I haven't really filmed it because I've been doing a lot of other things on the channel. So what we're going to do today is we're going to build a new ramp right here. If I have a clip uh, from the past, I'll put that up on the screen so you guys can see what used to be here. Uh, this guy got bigger since last time. So what I'm going to start with is this ramp right here. What I like to do is I like to keep my ramps as realistic as possible uh, and not use uh, big pieces of uh, big sheets of wood like I have here. I do use this occasionally, especially if I'm doing something in the street, which I've done videos with in the past. But back here, I definitely like to do something with dirt. I do usually put a filler piece, like a log or something. Um, and here, I'm going to show you guys what I've got for here. But I usually put a piece of wood, uh, so that way I don't use too much dirt. And then I just build up dirt on the edges. Down here, I've got two old cars that... Uh, that I used and this is just a piece of firewood it makes a perfect ramp and then back here this one's probably the only one that's still here since last time I put this uh, track on my channel and this is just a big cinder block with some dirt built around it it's a pretty tricky ramp to uh, to actually jump off of because it's kind of got these hard edges and it's pretty steep but it's very cool so this is what I've got so this is what I've got for uh, the ramp that's going to go right there. I'm very fortunate to have this very cool piece of wood, which is very heavy. And um, it's really hollow on the inside. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place it over there and uh, build some dirt around it. And hopefully this guy will make a nice ramp. All right, so that's placed down now. I've already got dirt here from what used to be here, so I'm just gonna kind of pile this up around the edges. Alright, that's pretty good. It's definitely a steeper ramp than what I've usually had on here. That one's, it looks steep on camera, but it's really not. This one you can really hit with a lot of speed and get a lot of, of uh, get a lot of air on distance. This one I think is going to be much more height. Uh, so we'll see. So, just going to work on that one a little bit, and then uh, we'll get a truck out and, uh, and we'll start driving. Perfect timing, battery just finished charging. My next video for my at-home projects during this time that we all have to spend at home, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to paint the Traxxas logo uh, on your sidewalls of your tires white. Uh, it's actually pretty cool because you get to see how fast the tires are actually spinning uh, through the air or around. So, I don't know, just a little thing that I decided to do while I was at home, and uh, I've done it to three out of the four of my trucks. Right now, I'm going to give you guys some onboard GoPro footage with the Monster Energy on the new track. Of course, I'm going to get some outside footage as well, but we're going to start with the GoPro. Let's hit it.
few ideas to share with you guys in the future, um, one of them being painting the sides of those tires. Uh, if you guys got anything else you think that I should do, uh, some at-home projects, please leave it down in the comments. I'm, in, I'm interested to see anything that you guys have. But for now, guys, uh, that's going to be the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed, please give it a like. Thanks, everyone, for watching. As always, I uh, hope everybody's doing okay. Stay safe. I'll see you guys next time on the RC Genius.